If you see this tree, run fast and yell for help. Plants and trees surround you pretty much wherever you go. In fact, there are over 3 trillion trees on our planet, way more than scientists thought just a decade ago. And that's great news since trees and other plants clean our air, help prevent water pollution and soil erosion, and provide us with oxygen and cooling shade on a hot day. Some of them even supply people with food. So basically, trees are awesome. Well, except for the ones that kill. After watching this video, you'll be much more cautious around certain tree species and probably won't even dare to come near them. Be ready for some shocking and scary information. You'll never forget this one tree that can literally rain acid on you. The Sandbox Tree Thank goodness this tree is really easy to recognize so that you'll know to stay far away from it. It can reach heights of 130 feet. Its trunk is covered with cone-shaped spikes, and its fruit looks like mini pumpkins. Every part of this tree is dangerous to people. If you get its sap in your eyes, blindness can become a frighteningly real possibility. If you accidentally eat the fruit, your body will have an almost instant reaction with cramps, vomiting, and diarrhea. And if all that isn't enough to keep you at a distance, when the fruit matures, it becomes dark brown and explodes, shooting seeds a whopping 150 miles per hour in all directions. You can imagine what a serious injury that could cause if you ever get in the way of these organic bullets. The Cherry Tree and its Relatives this might come as a surprise, but there's no mistake here, cherry trees can be extremely dangerous, especially for small children and dogs. The cherry tree's relatives include peach, plum, apricot, choke cherry, and other trees of this kind. All of them release particular chemicals that later metabolize into cyanide. If we talk about cherry trees in particular, you can find these chemicals throughout the plant, especially in high concentrations on fallen and wilted leaves. If a child or dog eats just one or two of this tree's leaves, they'll suffer from a horrible stomach ache. And if they eat more than that, they'll most likely end up with cyanide poisoning. So if you notice symptoms like weak pulse, seizures, dark urine and gums, and difficulties breathing, call for help immediately. Cyanide poisoning can easily and quickly become fatal. The Ohio Buckeye This is one more tree we bet you never suspected of presenting any sort of danger. But in fact, it's quite a threat. All parts of the Ohio buckeye tree contain saponins, which are chemicals that depress the central nervous system. Little kids, as well as pets, love playing with the brown shiny buckeye nuts that fall onto the ground. Just make sure that your little ones don't put them in their mouths. If children or dogs eat or chew on buckeyes, they'll most likely suffer from vomiting and diarrhea. Pets may have trouble breathing, or start to stagger and shake. If you have an Ohio Buckeye tree near your house, your best and safest bet is to pick up all the nuts and twigs and keep them out of your kids and pets' reach. The Apple and Crab Apple Tree Some more shocking news! Good old trusty apple trees aren't so trusty after all. They can be poisonous to different mammals, such as cats, dogs, and people. The thing is that just like the cherry tree, the leaves, stems, and seeds of this tree contain that very same chemical that's metabolized into cyanide during digestion. Again, fallen leaves are most dangerous than those still attached to the branches. But the biggest amount of the chemical is in the apple seeds themselves. Of course, you're unlikely to swallow 200 seeds or munch on 20 apple cores, which is the fatal dosage for people. 
But if pets and other animals eat too many apples, it can easily kill them. The Sabera odalum. This tree goes by another name, the suicide tree. It's clear from the nickname that this tree can take a life. It grows in South Asia and India, where some desperate people are willing to end their lives just by eating the extremely toxic fruit of this tree. When mature, these fruits look like miniature mangoes. You shouldn't ever eat them or touch the tree. Some of the tree's components are used to make deodorants and pesticides, but in its pure form, the Sabera odalum can be deadly. The Manchineal Tree If you travel to the Caribbean, the tropical parts of North America, or the northern parts of South America, you may notice trees marked with red crosses, warning signs, or a red ring painted on them. Do not do what radiologist Nicola Strickland did and never, ever approach this tree. Dr. Strickland and her friend were on vacation on the tropical Caribbean island of Tobago when they found some sweet-smelling green fruit resembling crab apples on the beach. Without even a moment's hesitation, they bit into the tempting fruit. After just a couple of seconds, the initial sweetness turned into a terrible burning sensation in their mouths. Terrifyingly, not only did the fruit taste awful, it also made their throat swell up to such a point that they couldn't swallow and could hardly breathe. The thing is that the unfortunate vacationers stumbled across the most dangerous tree in the world, also known as the Tree of Death. It has such a notorious reputation that it was even put in the Guinness Book of World Records in 2011. As strange as it might sound, the manchineal belongs to the diverse Euphorbia genus, which is the same family as the beautiful, yet also slightly toxic, Christmas poinsettia. And what exactly is so dangerous about the manchineal tree of death? Well, everything in short. Highly toxic milky sap oozes out of the tree's leaves, bark, and fruit. It contains all kinds of toxins, but the most lethal is formal. Due to the fact that this organic compound is water-soluble, you won't want to seek shelter from the rain under a manchineal tree. Raindrops will mix with the sap and really harm your skin, causing severe burns, blistering, and skin irritation. If you come across this tree, don't touch its bark either. As we've already mentioned, it's also covered in poisonous sap, and even if it comes into contact with your skin, it can cause blindness. Do not burn manchineal wood, even if you have nothing else at hand to start a fire. The smoke from this fire will definitely lead to eye inflammation and even temporary blindness. But the most dangerous thing you can do is eat poison guava. That's the nickname of the manchineal tree's fruit. In a shocking majority of cases, this careless action turns out fatal because terrible diarrhea and severe vomiting dehydrate the body to such an extent that there's no way to reverse the damage. What's more, even if you haven't swallowed the fruit but just bitten into it, its juice will lead to painful boils that will cover your throat and the insides of your mouth. Luckily, Nicola Strickland and her friend survived this near-death experience since they didn't have time to eat much of the poison apple. But when they told the locals what had happened to them, Nicola noticed the look of utter horror in their faces. The tourists were extremely lucky that after eight hours of intense pain, the swelling went away. And if you're sitting there wondering, why don't the locals just cut all the trees down? Well, that's a reasonable question, but it's more complicated than that. Manchineal trees play an extremely important role in the ecosystem. For example, since they grow in dense thickets, they protect Central American beaches from erosion and serve as windbreakers. Have you ever had to deal with any of the dangerous trees mentioned in the video? Tell us in the comments below!
Don't forget to click subscribe to stay on the bright side of life.